Hey, what's up guys? Tom and I are Tina 2 here at Retribution Gaming, and in this video we're going to be quickly going over the Talon of Pyre. Okay, so, to reach Talon of Pyre is very simple. Come over to the Undercroft, head down the steps, make our way out, and we're going to turn left. We're then going to go up the hill to reach some rocks, we're going to jump up the rocks, and then you will be at the Talon of Pyre's spawn zone. This is what it looks like when Talon of Pyre has already been killed and is on a cooldown. However, this is what it looks like when Talon of Pyre is up. The area will have this flame wall around it, and then when you go inside you'll be able to see the boss and some minions for you to kill as well. So, to start with in this example, we're just gonna go and clear trash before we end up focusing the boss. Should also be noted, that this fight does go a little quicker if you have a couple of friends helping you but solo just requires a decent build to do it most of talon of pyre's attacks are area based they are not blockable with a two hand as well as shown in the video with that said though his single target attacks can be blocked with a two-hander in this example i wanted to show just how much damage talon of pyre can do if you're not paying attention so I want to feed a little here and just take a couple of hits just to show off how much damage he's doing. If you're on a squishy if Wayfinder like Kairos and this, kind of don't get away with being able to do this. You will just get like flat out done. However though, it's a pretty straightforward fight. It's basically dodge the AoEs, block or avoid the single target damage that he does and just burn him down as fast as possible. Let's now just skip ahead until we get to the last point in the fight. One thing to also take note of, while you're fighting Tan on the Pyre, while you're in his area, you also will be taking a small damage over time effect as well. It's not noticeable too much in this video because I'm on Wingrave and it's constant healing, but on other wayfinders you may notice that you'll start taking some damage. Okay, so here's the last point about the fire wire to make. When you see Talon of Pyre do this animation, you basically want to be dumping as much damage as you possibly can to get this fight quick and over with. Because, however, if you don't do it quick enough, if you fail that DPS check, he will just time out. He will just disappear, or in other cases of this point in early access, just T-pose and stay there. He won't you won't be able to kill him, he's meant to have disappeared. Okay, so let's get on to the loot table. Some of the notable drops are obviously gonna be things like Titan's Bane Essence, Hellswarm Essence, Pyre's Torch, Talon of Pyre Echo, and of course, you then have some chances to get like the Urban Might accessory, Storm's Fury, the Greater Chimeric Blood Brew Free, among other things. That's all for this video, pretty much just keep in mind at this point in time that Talon of Pyre goes on a 2 hour cooldown once you kill him. You can also quicken this up just by server hopping, simply log out and then log back in to try and get into a different server where he may be up. If you found this video helpful at all, don't forget to smash that like button, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. I'm Tominator T92 of Retribution Gaming, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.